Yeah, I definitely want to um, thank um, Senator Bratton and Senator Crawford for allowing us to put that ban in the state treasurer's office related to the federal digital currency. A federal digital currency would be a complete violation to personal property rights if the federal government was tracking your every purchase. Um, they could come after your guns. They could come after who knows what, um, but just with a flip of switch. So um, I definitely want to thank Senator Bratton and Crawford for helping get that done. Are oh, you there, Senator Koenig? Can you talk about where we stand? on the big education bill, your ESA bill. Is it next week? What, what's going on behind the scenes? Yeah, I really don't, we're in negotiations with everybody in the Senate right now. And so I really don't want to say too much while those negotiations are going on. I'm hopeful that we can get to a place where we can bring it to the floor um, um, you know, with um, some kind of compromise that will be workable. Okay. Do you mind uh, commenting more on the dispute with the state treasurer? We saw a lot of it play out this week his his ads appearing on those torch machines. What's your position on that and how should the- Yeah, I definitely think that was inappropriate um, of the state treasurer to do something like that. Um, those those machines are, you know, definitely questionable and, and they should not be advertised on that. And so, uh, you know, and I also thought it was inappropriate for him not to show up to a committee meeting that was asked for in the house. Um, he should have showed up and answered questions right away. You introduced SJR 87 this mm -hmm. week. It was just heard in committee today. Um, would you consider the introduction of SJR 87 a strategy um, to um, respond to the Missouri or Missourians? Yeah, I mean, I think we need to. I, I think we need to. If we're going to put something on the ballot, we need to provide voters with an option, um, an option that it protects, um, you know, un, you know, the 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 child that's in the womb. But then it also protects mothers um, if you know if their life is under threat, and also help to promote. Um, you know, after the child is born through pregnancy resource centers. And so I think it's a, if we're going to put some, if the, it, through the initiative petition process, they're going to try to create a right to an abortion, we should have an alternative for voters to vote on something else.